Hey, hey, y'all. Okay, so I'm about to do an unboxing of my new juicer, and I want to share with you all. So here we go. All right, so here is my juicer. It's a Nama J2 juicer. Um, I heard a lot of really great things about this particular juicer from uh, two influencers. One is Joe Cross, if you're familiar with the movie Fat, Sick, and Nearly Dead. Um, he promotes this juicer and also Christina from the YouTube channel Fully Raw. Um, she talks about this juicer a lot and she's really the reason why I bought this particular one. So I'm excited to open it. You see how big this box is. So let's get it cracked open. All right, so my little three-year-old is also in here with me. So you may hear her noise or little baby boy's noise or my 15-year-old. Okay, here we go. dandy scissors my three-year-old is really excited about the juicer i don't want to put her on camera but she may make a camera all right here we go now one of the things that i've heard about nama is they are very very precise with the packaging so look at that thank you wow and hello i guess i should have did that the other way hello and thank you so that's pretty nice okay very user-friendly packaging. Yeah. Oh, this is heavy. No. Oh, my goodness. Wow, it's <laughs> apples on it. Wow, look at that. Yeah, it's so cool. Okay, so let's get this open. Yeah. This All right, pretty. here we go. Got it on the counter. It says open here. Okay. See, again, very user-friendly packaging. All right, here we go. I'm opening the lid. And now let's see. From Mommy, Nama. Let me see it. Namawell.com. Mommy, I want to see it. I hope it. this does not fall. Mommy, okay. I want to see it. I'll let you see it in a second, baby. Okay, so again, very user-friendly. See how they have everything laid out <laughs> and labeled? All right, let's open up each individual box. All right, I was getting ready to try to pick up something else, but it clearly says chamber set a quick start guide start here so we're gonna start there what up? okay so here we go and now we need all right that's what we all need oh so so friendly a warm yeah. welcome from nama okay okay now. so try to pull this out If you all can't tell, I'm like trying to record this with one hand, so things might get a little awkward. Wow. Okay, so this is like the main part of the machine. Hi, let's go to see it. Get this one wrapped. No. The last one. Okay, so there was this layering guide on the inside of the machine. Yeah. Um, very helpful. Yeah shows you how to put mm -hmm. vegetables and fruit inside of the machine so this is the main part where all of the juicing happens all right and here is the quick start guide and user manual and recipe book very helpful i can't wait to get into that um let's see what's inside Ooh, so pretty okay so this is the quick start guide, instruction manual, and recipe book. Cool. I'm sure there's a lot of res good recipes in here that I'm gonna wanna try. This looks like one right here. Okay, and this is the base, very simple button and functioning. Um, comes with this core here. So obviously that part back there goes on top of this. So we'll be adding that shortly. And this is the pusher and the cleaning brush. Let me take this out. Okay, the cleaning brush here, which is pretty cool. And then this is to help push down the vegetables and fruit if you need to. All right, so this is the juice container 
And this is the pulp container. Comes with a nice little lid. And it also has measuring on the side, which is super helpful. And this is the strainer. And voila, here we go. So this is the fully assembled juicer. And this is the juice side. This is the pulp side. So I think what I'm going to do now is do a little recipe from the book and try it out. All right. So I've got my veggies and fruit here that I'm going to cut. I've already cleaned them. Um, and you notice my celery is looking a little, a little interesting. So I'm going to cut that off. And that's the thing about juicing. Like even if your fruit or veggies might look quote unquote ugly, you can always cut off the bruised parts or the parts that uh, may be starting to go a little bit bad and you can still juice them so they're not going to waste. So I'm going to cut these up and then put them in the juicer. Okay, so here we go. I'm about to put up my chopped fruits and veggies <laughs> into the machine. So this is the moment of truth. I guess I'm supposed to turn this on first and I'm supposed to put the softer fruits and veggies at the bottom and then put the harder ones at the top. Okay, here we go. Actually, I'm gonna put some kale in here too, but let me turn the machine on. It's plugged in. So I'm gonna put some kale in here. Thank you, Nikkei. That's okay. I got it. I'm gonna put my kale, and then I'm supposed to put the softer fruits in here. So there's my lemon, and then um the celery and the cucumber. I'll just uh, go ahead and put everything in. All right, so I'll put everything in, and I'm going to turn it on. Here we go. And this is a color press juicer. So there's no heat or very little heat being added. As you can see, the juice is loaded up. And the pulp is coming out on the other side. Pretty cool. Alright, so this is the part I usually use on these videos. Ooh, it's so satisfying when the juice comes out. There we go. Our first batch of juice. Alright, so here is the finished result. So here's the juice. This is how much juice was yielded. And then here is the pulp. And if you look at the consistency of the pulp, it's actually pretty dry. So I um, took some in my fingers a little while ago just to see how moist it was. And it's, I mean, of course it's moist, but you can tell that this machine extracted as much juice as possible from the fruits and veggies. So yeah, so let's see what it tastes like. Okay, so here we go. Here is the juice. So the juice actually yielded enough to fit inside this glass, which was good. I did strain it first. Um, I strained it into the glass. So as you can see, that was pretty important because there was a lot of pulp and um, fiber that was still in the juice before I strained it. So that's that. So I'm gonna taste it. It's not cold. Um, so bottoms up. Okay, that's pretty good. I was a little concerned that it wasn't gonna be sweet, but it has a nice flavor. Um, just enough sweetness, just enough tartness from the lemon, and of course I can taste the veggies, so two thumbs up. Well, I hope you all enjoyed this video and expect to see more juicing videos from me in the very near future um, because I'm actually working on a juice certification professional juicer certification so you're going to see a lot more information regarding juicing and healthy living from me talk to you soon i just wanted to add that all of my kids really like the juice even my 11 month old baby so it's a winner